I'm Amanda Heisey with The Observer. We're here in downtown Sarasota. We're asking people how they feel about a proposed charter that would include an elected mayor. It's a contentious topic, so let's see what people think. There is a, a new charter proposed that would have us have an elected mayor. How do you feel about that? I signed the petition and I'm strongly in favor of it. Why? Well, I think we need a little bit more longevity, a little bit more commitment to the position. I come from a corporate background, so it's not your president for today and tomorrow. No, you, you're signed on for the mission and you're judged on your accomplishments. And I think our mayor should be the same situation. I have a friend that was a former planner for the city of Sarasota, and she claims that the biggest problem at City Hall is that no one can agree on anything. And if there were a strong presence, uh, figurehead leader, call him what you may, maybe they could unite the people. I have lived in a city where it was city manager. City managers can come and go. Um, sometimes you get a good one and then they get a better job and they're gone. With an elected official, it, it works. I think it's the right thing to do. I think it's the people's choice to do that. I don't think it's the commissioner's choice to do that. I really don't. I think that having a centralized uh, mayor or any authority over any kind of effort or institution probably is more beneficial than doing it by the village principal or by uh, community or by group. Do you know who the mayor of Sarasota is? I know what sex is. It's a woman, isn't it? Do you know who our mayor is of Sarasota? No. Do you know who our mayor is in Sarasota? No. Do you know who our mayor is? I don't. I know it rotates, so uh, it's, musical, it's musical chairs. 